Hi, my name's Paul Cresswell. Welcome to Paul's Tackle Reviews. The purpose of this channel is to give you some reviews of tackle and related items that have been out on the bank, tried and tested by an unbiased, unsponsored angler, and that's me. As I say with all of my videos, I'll try and give you as much information as I can about a product but there's no guarantee that if something works for me it's going to work for you. Today I'm looking at sunglasses and I'm not looking at buying a pair of just pure sunglasses I'm looking at over sunglasses that's for people who need glasses to fish to see what they're doing but also need some eye protection. If you want to see what damage the sun can do to your eyes, then search on the internet. I haven't got any medical qualifications, but a lot of people wear a hat when they're fishing and thinking that's protecting their eyes. But there's also a real risk of doing some damage with the reflection off the water that we inevitably get when we're out and fishing on the bank. The other advantages of wearing sunglasses, as far as I can see, is it does help if you get the right lens in the right conditions, it helps you see the flow. And there's been occasions where I, it isn't particularly bright and I've put my sunglasses on and I've seen my flow an awful lot better. Obviously, everybody knows if you're wearing polarised glasses, then you can see fish and you can spot fish better great if you may be mugging fish or trying to mug them and the other one for me and this year has been the worst year ever I've had for hay fever and I do feel putting glasses on and keeping your eyes enclosed does help reduce the impact of hay fever on your eyes. So the first thing to say is I need glasses to fish and I have a pair of bifocals so I look through the top there when I'm looking at my flow and I look through the bottom when I'm putting the bait on the hook. I've got these little plastic things on the outside there just so that they don't fall off and when I'm fishing I need these glasses on to see. Now you could buy a separate pair of prescription sunglasses and then you'd be carrying two glasses, increasing your chance of losing something and you've also got to swap between them or whatever. So you can get glass sunglasses that go over the top of these that then mean you're fishing in sunglasses. And a few years ago I bought, and I'm talking four or five years ago, I paid seven quid, I think it was, for these off eBay. And it said they're polarised and offer all kinds of protection, but you do worry maybe with seven quid what you're getting. But I've used these for several years and I put them over there and you can see they cover the sides and they have an amber lens and they have been fantastic pair of over sunglasses. They have got a little bit scratched over time and, and a little bit worse for wear. And I was looking on the internet for other alternatives and maybe something with a bit more guarantee of protection and appreciating I might have to spend a little bit more money. And I found a company called Cocoon and I think they're mainly an American company but they sell in the UK and they even sell through some opticians in the UK. So if you go on their website, I'll obviously put it on the bottom there, um, then you can type in the width and the height of your sunglasses, so uh, your normal glasses. So what you need to do is get a ruler out, measure the absolute maximum side to side, and then the maximum height of your, some, your normal prescription glasses. And you can put that into their website it will then come up with all the different types of and sizes and styles of over sunglasses that they have 
that can work for you. Now, these are fairly big glasses and I think I've got the over glasses that are the biggest in their range. And um, you can then pick a colour of the frame and there's lots of colours of frames. And then you also need to pick a lens colour as well. And you can have grey, amber, copper, yellow, blue, green, silver, gold. There's all kinds there. They do guarantee 100% UVA and UVB protection for your eyes. So if you go through their website, it does advise on the colour of lens that is best for certain applications. And all the time when they're talking about uh, working near water, they advise an amber lens. And my original cheapies, they were an amber lens. I found them brilliant for giving contrast in water conditions when you're looking out across water. So I ordered the Cocoon over glasses. These are called the Style Line MX and I went for a black frame, but you can have all, all colors of frames if you so wish. And I went for their polarized amber lenses in there. Now, these were 60 pounds and I think that's a reflection of the quality of the, the product. They are a plastic frame that's very strong. And if you go on their, their website, they've actually got a video of somebody driving over some, not that I'd recommend it, and they came back to life, no problem. They also have wire in the arms and you can adjust that up or down to get a nice tight fit. They came really quickly, I think it was a couple of days they came and you also get um, quite a nice case to take them to the bank. You get a cleaning cloth that I occasionally remember to take with me. Uh, you get a little pouch if you want to carry them in, in a pouch. But I know it came with a cleaning cloth, but generally I tend to use these kind of baby wipes. I also use these for sometimes just wiping my pole down if it's got a bit of dirt, a bit of ground weight on it. They're great. I find that's a really good way of doing it. So I will now put them on. And you can see that they're wider, than, obviously wider than my normal glasses, very similar to the other ones. And they've also got some uh, small glass panels at the side there. So you're fully enclosed, have hardly any gap there or any gap at the top. And you can see on the top of them, they have like um, a ridge a ridged area there which stops the light getting in from all angles and sometimes you can be sat in glasses and the sun's over the shoulder and you can see it in your lens and this doesn't happen with these they're a nice comfy fit and they have never come off when i've uh, when i've been fishing if the sun's out i put them on but there are occasions where the sun isn't out and I'm struggling to see my flow, maybe got a white background, really struggling, and I'll wear them again because it gives you a better contrast and the, you'll find those days by trial and error. I'm really pleased with these. Um, I know that they're nearly 10 pound, 10 times more expensive than the cheapies, but I'm, I'm not buying off eBay, I'm buying off a company. They come with a lifetime guarantee um, and you register them when you buy them. I bought them off their website and that covers for any kind of defects in manufacturer or anything going wrong with them. I think they're, they're built to last and these will last an awful long time. And I saw a John Arthur video the other day and he'd lost his prescription sunglasses and he said he was wearing his cocoon fitovers. Now, 
what I will say is you're not going to win any fashion competitions. They do look very big. You're not going to find me walking down the high street with these on. These are for fishing and contrary to what some people think, fishing is not a fashion contest. But also, I think if you if you drive a lot and you maybe don't have prescription sunglasses but you need glasses to drive this would be fine for driving you could just pop them on and you would have no problems whatsoever i i recommend these there's one or two other people have reviewed them not from an angling point of view on youtube if you want to have a look i think they're really well made built to last and importantly offer protection That's it for today's video. I don't need those when I'm sat inside. Um, I'm pulling together some more videos. I think we're getting towards 50 videos on the channel now. So if you want to have a look at those, if you want to hit like, that's great, spurs me on. And if you want to subscribe, obviously you'll then pick up automatic notifications of any future videos. Until next time, tie lines.